Let me bring in Janet Shamlian. Uh, she's our NBC correspondent who is based in that area. Janet, first, um, what have you heard, if anything, from some of your contacts uh, who uh, are, are working this door and who may even be on their way there to help secure the situation? Well, it sounds like the injuries may be fairly critical because they're bringing them, Cameron, to the Texas Medical Center, and there are medical facilities that are closer uh, to this campus than the Texas Medical Center, which is in downtown Houston. Only the most serious cases go there, so we know that Life Flight, uh, the helicopter service, has brought at least one injury and possibly two to the medical center for treatment. As you said, this is a campus about 20, 25 miles um, north of downtown Houston. It's a community campus with a number of different locations. And you mentioned a shelter in place uh, alert that is posted on the school's website. Uh, what we're hearing is that the gunman may be still at large, that the person who was taken away in handcuffs may in fact not be the gunman, but somebody wanted for questioning, mm -hmm. but that there are reports, as you indicated, that someone has fled into the nearby wooded area around the campus. Uh, there is a neighborhood just adjacent to that campus, and that they're on the search right now uh, for a suspect who fled wearing a red shirt, a black male, uh, is what is being reported mm -hmm. on the local news here, Tamron. Uh, tell me a little bit more uh, about this campus, Janice. Uh, Jan uh, Janice. I I've been uh, getting our team to get more information according to what we've been able to uncover. Obviously, it sounds like a small college in this area, about 18,000 students. Uh, it, it, it's it, technical, it's, technical and GED okay. uh, type training. Uh -huh. You know, it's not one of the major universities here like Rice or the sure. University of Houston, but it is, in fact, a large campus, mm -hmm. as you can see from some of the aerials in terms of size. Uh, and it is surrounded by a wooded area. Again, about uh, 20 miles, a good 20 miles north of the center of the city of Houston. And, and right now we're being told um, Texas Medical Examiner's Office uh, confirming to NBC News at this point as of 2.25 Eastern time that they've not been notified of any fatalities at Lone Star College. But that does not mean that uh, victims have not been taken who are in critical condition, which we discussed uh, with Janet.